Hello YouTube, welcome back. Today we're going to be setting up an SD card for the Mister. I'm going to show you what programs you need to do this and files and also how to transfer the files onto your SD card and how to set them up on the Mister. Firstly we'll head over to the laptop and we'll take a look at what you need. The first program we'll download is called Balena Etcher. This allows us to burn the image file we're going to download onto the SD card. The second thing is the image file itself, called it's called Mr Fusion. I'll put all the links in the description below for all the files you need here. Third thing would be update all. This will update everything to the latest cores and keep you updated. And last but not least, FileZilla. We'll be using this for transferring files over to the master. So let's go ahead and get started. For purposes of this video I'm going to be using a 128GB micro SD card. Let's go plug that into the PC. So the first thing we're going to do here is load up Belena Etcher. We're going to select the Mr. Fusion file we've downloaded. And then select the SD card. and then flash to start the process. This is quick, this should only take less than a minute to do this. Okay, now that's done. We can take the card out and plug that into the mister. We want to put the micro SD card into the primary SD card slot on the master board. And now powering up the master we can let this run its course. It should only take a few minutes. Ok now that that's done, the next step is to connect to the internet, if you've got an ethernet cable plug that in, on my case I'm going to use a Wi-Fi dongle so I'm going to put in the details for that. Now we are connected to the internet, we want to go to the scripts. For purposes of this video I'm using a PS5 controller. I've plugged it in via a USB cable. So if we go to scripts and press circle, click yes and don't ask again. And now we want to run the update file. This will take around 5 to 10 minutes, so we'll just let that do this. What we'll do now, this is complete, is we'll head back over to the laptop and transfer the update all file, file over to the Vista. So 
So what we're going to do now is we'll load up FileZilla. You want to go to Site Manager, create a new site called Mist Mister. Put in your IP address. You'll find that if you press X on the Mister and press Left and the username, which is root and password one, and then connect. Okay, now you want to move into the root of the folder. So now we want to find the media folder. And then the fat folder and scripts. So what we'll do now is drag the update all file into the scripts folder. While we're here I'll show you how to add games as well. So we come back out of that. We're still in the fat folder. Go into the games folder and you'll see all the systems have their own names so if we go into say take SNES we've got a SNES game so we'll drag that over to the SNES folder and that's how you transfer your games over every system's got its own named folder so it's relatively easy to find them and put them in the right places so let's head back over to the master now we're going to go into scripts and run update all. Before this fully runs we want to go into the settings so press up and we want to enable a couple of things before going forward. We want to enable the BIOS database and we'll enable Arcade ROMs database. We'll save and now we'll exit and run update all. This will take around 10 to 15 minutes, this is quite a lengthy process, so we'll come back to that once we're finished. Okay, now that that's done, we can play some games and enjoy it. If we go into the SNES folder, we'll see the game we dropped in there earlier on. Thank you. 
Thanks again for watching, I hope this helps somebody out. If you like the content and want to see some future stuff, please like and subscribe. There will be plenty more videos to come. See you again, thank you, bye bye.